I think it appears originally in Freud's wit and its relation to the unconscious. And it goes like this, I'm paraphrasing. Um, I would never want to belong to any club that would have someone like me for a member. Of course not. I mean, this is just so crazy. This is something that has been thoroughly looked at 25 years ago by all the authorities and everybody came to the conclusion that it was untrue. And that was the end and I've gone on with my life and now for it to come back now, I mean, my God, it's, it's a terrible thing to accuse a person of, uh, you know. I mean, I'm a man with a family and my own children and, um, you know, so of course it's upsetting. So yesterday I was, I was doing you know, research for, for having you on and uh, just reading up and then I saw a, a clip of uh, Mia Farrow who was, you know, the, she adopted yeah. her. And, Sunni uh, Previn and her daughter and, Dylan and her, Farrow her, was uh, uh, molested. Mo was Leon. molested and, mm -hmm. I, you know, when you're, when you're doing this type of research, I came up to a, a clip of the 90s of a leaked, uh, a, like a tapped I audio. haven't listened to it, but I've heard it's, of it. Yeah. So, and I showed it to Pat yesterday. I I got emotional in this prep meeting because it's Mia Farrow and Woody Allen's on the phone and she's telling disturbing. She, it's I, I'm gonna get emotional right now. She's she's crying. Mind you, this is her adopted daughter. Yeah, and describing what the uh, the rape and the abuse that he did to a seven year old girl. And Pat heard this and he was in shock. We had to hear it twice. So if it's right, this is a tapped phone call from Woody Allen talking to Mia F Farrow, and this is they're talking about Dylan. Who yeah. was the seven-year-old at the time? And what I'm playing, Ron. Through. You will not let me get it. You have to wait beyond that now. What you've done to Suni, what you've done to, to, to Dylan, what you've done to Dylan, Dylan's a baby. How could you do that to her? I don't know anything of the kind. I know what Dylan tells me. You've told me nothing but lies. Dylan tells the truth inconsistently. No, I don't know that, Woody. I've always, always wor been worried about you and Dylan. And I didn't know the doctor had to report this to the authorities. I didn't know that. I went just to be sure she was all right. And she's not all right, Woody. She walks around the house holding her vagina. She sleeps with me. Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up.